Hello and welcome to Watch Us Play Barrel Rummy, a game for two players. Now, if you remember John Burton, he's one of the featured channels on this channel in the description. And he's come up with this interesting two-player card game called Barrel Rummy, where all you need is a deck of cards and the two jokers. You can use coins as your marker if you want. But essentially, you have a hand of four cards that's dealt to you. And each turn, you discard one card, and that allows your token to move that many number of spaces. Face cards, of course, can move to any space, and essentially the game goes on from there. Uh, I'm not going to give you the best description of how to play it uh, to get the more informed video from the original source. Look in the description. It will be there for your enjoyment. But basically, you score on specific hands of these four card melds, and each one of these melds will have a different number of cards that you take. Each card is going to be worth one point at the end of the game, so trying to get better melds uh, will serve you well later. And the game ends essentially when the deck runs out. Now you could say the game ends, but really it's just the round of the game ends. As far as how many points to play this to or what predetermined stopping point, that's a very big uh, debate. You could play a best of seven game. You could play till somebody gets a certain number of points and whoever has the most points at the end once that threshold is crossed, uh, that could be your the perfect place to decide where to end the game. Say somebody gets 200 points, then you end the game and whoever has the most points wins. Uh, that could be a good way to do it because both players are going to be scoring about 10 to 20 points each uh, game depending on how many cards they capture. So now I just declared a three of a kind because I had three cards of the same value and a face card, which is the requirement for three of a kind in this game. If you use a numerical card, of course, to uh, get on top of somebody else's token, their turn is skipped and you get to do two turns. So that's what just, just what happened there. Now we declare a two of a kind and two cards were drawn in extra for that. And the hand was replenished. And the game keeps going now. This was our first attempt at this game, so there's not a lot of strategy written about this game. There's not a lot of fine coaching points. We're kind of learning it as we go as far as what the best strategy is. Somewhat unknown at this point, since it is a new game, just invented this past year. Uh, but I can tell you a very interesting way of doing a melding rummy in which you get to get more cards based on the value of those melds. And then now we just ended the game, the deck has been depleted, so we take our hand and discard it. And then we're going to count up all our cards, and whoever has the most points is going to win. So it's one point for each card, and that's who's going to, going to win this round. And it's uh, 20 to 19, so it's a one point difference. And so I think uh, 200 points is probably a fair uh, point value uh, to get to. Uh, some games you'll score more than 20, sometimes, sometimes you'll score more. But if you actually want to attempt this out in public with people that you don't know, come to our subreddit card game meetups. And when you get there, actually post your city. People are joining, which is great, but they're not posting their city. We need some cities posted. We need some options here. Do click under the description under the show more and you'll see all the pertinent links, including a link to a Discord channel where we talk about card games all day, every day. We even have one just for solitaires. Do call your friends up and let them know that you want to play some cards and you want to play somewhere soon and they need to meet you up so we can play some card games. Who knows, maybe they'll meet up. And while you're on the phone with them, do tell them about this channel. Do like, subscribe, and share. Let people know that this channel exists and we got some games nobody else covers. And I want to thank today's musician, Dale Mathis Accordion, for his excellent accordion music, as always. He covered the Beer Barrel Polka which is just a classic song and perfect for barrel rummy. So thank you so much for allowing us to use your music and check out his channel and I'll see you next video.